Well, again, thank you for everyone for being here. Uh, this has been quite a journey for us. Um, you know, getting a call from a friend of mine in Lafayette saying, whoa, hey, who's this kid who just won the two-lane race? Uh, I don't know. I wasn't sure that he had even gone to two-lane that day. And I said, well, all right, you know, this is back going into your junior year. Uh, so back in, in, we knew we had something special. I share with Brandon today. Uh, probably the memory that I'll take with me was uh, having one of our punt returners get hurt in pregame, and then the other guys looking at me going, what are we going to do? And I said, hey, Z, go catch punts. Okay, coach. And in the back of my mind, I just thought, I wonder if it's too big for him. I wonder if the moment's too big. And then when he, he caught the ball, I said, I hope he gets into the wall or he's going to get himself killed. And then he returned for a touchdown. And then that's when we knew right there we had something special. Uh, again, it's, it's, it's been a, a tremendous journey uh, for us to get to this point. Uh, the legacy and the leadership that you left on our program is, is definitely going to carry us into the future. And uh, probably the, the one thing that um, I, I can say about him, obviously we all know about his athletic talent, uh, is the reason why I think UL is getting probably the steal of the class. Um, is when college coaches asked me about Brandon, I always told them you were a no-worry guy. Well, coach, what does that mean, a no-worry guy? Well, you're not going to have to worry about him that he's going to go to class. You're not going to have to worry about him that he's going to do his homework. He's always going to be where he needs to be. He's always going to do those things. So I referred to Brandon as a no-worry guy. And um, through, through Brandon, Brandon's given, given us an opportunity to have some great schools come through our, our place, Army, TCU, Notre Dame. A lot of people have been able to come down. And it's been just to see you. So that's, that's a definite uh, compliment to your ability. But it, being a no-worry guy doesn't come from not having a great home life. So Mr. John, Ms. Monique, he's the re you're the reason he's a no-worry guy. Uh, and it's his brothers and sisters and, you know, having Tom. Tom was a no-worry guy, too. I didn't have to worry about Tom. But again, uh, UL's getting a great guy, great, great athlete, great player. Like I said, they're getting a no-worry guy. So uh, congratulations to me. It's been fun. Look forward to the, looking forward to Lafayette and in the future. Uh, before I sign, I, I first want to congratulate Sam uh, being in the same grade as you, growing up with you. Uh, I've seen the work you put in, and all I can say is it's well deserved, it's earned, really. You know, your hard work, and I hope nothing but the best for you. Um, secondly, I want to I want to thank. My coaching staff, uh, my friends, uh, my teammates, I couldn't have done it without y'all. Every day y'all would push me, make me work a little harder, you know, just strive a little, a little further. Um, to my parents, uh, I couldn't say enough about y'all. Y'all been my rock every time things have gotten a little tough. I've always turned to y'all and y'all always been there to kind of to guide me and, and teach me the lessons I need through life. And um, last but certainly not least, um, God, of course, for not only giving me the opportunity to play at the next level, but more importantly, having all of you here right now uh, as a support system and to have a loving family, I, I can't thank them enough.